welcome back to Opal and Mint. I'm Ashley. I'm Kylie. And today we're gonna be painting Christmas cards together. If you are new here, I do watercolor. Kylie does not. I do not. But today she is going to, we're gonna be painting Christmas card, Christmas cards went together. Oof in my face. <laughs> so I'm going to be showing her how to paint Christmas cards and in the process, showing you. So we're gonna flip the camera down to the table so you're gonna be seeing our hands and you're gonna see us paint Christmas cards together and probably just hear our conversation um, because that's half of the fun is listening to what we say to each other because we say some- It's a carved cone. It's a carved cone. We have some sayings that happen in our videos that uh, we now say in our daily life because we laugh so hard at them. So if you haven't seen our art dice video, art dice video, we say a curved cone. Kylie says it's a curved cone. It's and curved what was the cone. other saying? Boca balls. Boca balls. It was the same video. The same. same video. Okay. So boca balls and curved cone are from that video. So if we've intrigued you, go watch that. <laughs> but anyways, we're going to see what else happens and what else we say today. But let's go ahead and get to painting because I have 40 minutes before I have to go pick up my child. So yikes. We're gonna do two cards so we gotta hurry. All right guys, so we're here. We're gonna be using the, again, I, Kylie, say this brand. <laughs> Tumurata is how I say it. Tu, Tumurata? I have no idea. Tum, Anyways. Could be Tum, Tum, Tum. Uh, tum, Tum, Tum. tum Tumurata. <laughs> I don't know, but this is the paper we're gonna be using. This it's is cat. This is, <laughs> with strips. <laughs> This is 100% cotton, 140 pound, and these are five by seven. So, here's your paper. Paper. Yes. This first one we're gonna be doing is the simplest of simple things that you could ever possibly do. And watch me still mess it up somehow. You're not gonna mess it up. Positive thoughts, positive thoughts. Okay, so we're gonna be using my Daniel Smith paints and let me pick out some happy brushes. Some happy brushes. Happy little brushes. That one's not. Happy little trees. I can't believe Grandpa didn't know what Bob Ross was. I'm so glad we introduced Bob Ross to him. <laughs> okay. There's some brushes to choose from. We are just going to be painting circles, okay? It's as simple as that. Painting a circle, okay? <laughs> the circles are hard. They don't have to be perfect. Well, now, obviously. if you want... Now, a lot of people do where they put the paint on the... Thing and do that and then blend it. You can do that if you what, want. And, and what? Blend it. Blend it. You blend it out. Blend it out. But I like the irregularities of these. I think they're more. I think they look nice. I just don't know if I can do that. You can. That. You can. All right, pick a brush. All right, so pick a color, any color. Pick a color. Get your water, get your brush wet. I have not done this in so long. That's fine. This is why we're instructing. Okay. Um, I, I can't actually have the water here. I'm going to do that, okay? Okay, that's fine. Um, because I always have my water past my paint. That's fine. It's just a thing. Okay, it's a thing. It's a thing. All right, I'm going to pick a color for me first. You can pick whatever you want. This is a green, and all you're going to do is pick a spot on your paper and go like this with a little bit of paint. I don't think I got any paint. That one takes a little bit to re-wet, so get lots of water on is it. Is it shiny? Um slightly it's well, then, it's it's what's on this back here it's only a tiny bit shiny gotcha because it looks like a pretty color it is pretty that's fine you so to do a circle uh, lightly and then we'll add color to the outside of it am i getting paint yeah you've got paint on it do it yeah that's enough okay for okay. the see the light little light layer okay so do your light layer and then you're going to add paint to the edge of it after your light layer okay so, do just do a circle, sweetie. I don't know how to do a circle. I use pencils. Step one is put the paintbrush on the paper. <laughs> this is called overthinking, folks. And the cool thing with watercolor is you can adjust your shape as you go. Like, I just made mine a little bit wider on this side. It has a boom. <laughs> then see, adjust it. You can finagle. Finagle? Finagle it. And again, I like the whimsicalness. See, look, I'm going around and going wider on mine. You said something about edges. What did you say? No, so after you have your first layer down, get a bunch of whatever paint you have, and you're gonna tap darker paint on the edge of your ball. 
your ornament, your circle. See, get some darker paint and just add it on in there. See, it's cute. <laughs> See, it's cute. See, you like it? It is. It's, it's, I don't know yet. Okay, you don't know yet. It's 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 in the framework. Okay. It is it is barely there. <laughs> we shall see. Beautiful. Now do another color okay. and another circle. Okay. Um, I want blue and I'm gonna go over here. I forget which blue I just put my brush in, which one's what? I think it's this one. <laughs> a pretty blue and you can do them slightly different sizes if you want I can never tell how much paint I have on here. yeah that comes with practice and also it comes with look I, I'm used to doing this now but if you um, put it on here you know you can yeah. kind of see the thickness of paint and um, but I'm just used to painting and I just go sometimes but Kind of add some paint wherever you want it. Beautiful. It's a little wonky dog. It's okay. Like I said, you can adjust and move it around. And, and then if you also, I forgot what color's on my brush. Um, if you want to do like a messy version of this, like if you don't want to worry about your edges, you can like, I'm just, I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna go for it. I'm taking a clean water and I'm just gonna do that. And I'm gonna make some of them bleed. This still cracks me up. The word bleed? Yes. Am I too light or are they okay? No, they're beautiful, Kylie. Okay. I like them a lot. And once you have like a whole page full full of them, you know? And like I'm gonna take this and I'm gonna go right here and do wet on wet and just have like like it's one in the background. If you want to stick to this, stick to this. Do what you want. I have to pick another color. Hmm. I'm picking colors. That's okay. I have not mastered that skill yet. And I also don't know what colors are what. So yeah. That doesn't help. Yeah. Like I don't know what color this is. It's a very vibrant blue. It's very beautiful. Yeah, put it on there and you'll be able to see it. Oh, okay. Yeah, that's pretty. But the point of this also is no mistakes. Do what you want. Make it messy, make it neat, make it whatever you want. I was trying to fix it and I went. <laughs> That's funny. Oh no. I don't want it. That, that helps. Awesome. <laughs> I still have it. Oh. <laughs> You threw your brush. <laughs> well, I didn't throw it, I dropped it, but yes. I did throw it, I dropped it. I'm clumsy. <laughs> what? Nothing, I'm just... You're laughing at my splatter? No, slap cheetah. Because I slap. <laughs> I'm just laughing at us. This is the essence of us. Yes. This color would be pretty for yours. That is pretty I started to get it and I'm like, no, that goes on yours, not mine. That goes on <laughs> yours, not mine. <laughs> Deciding where to pick things as well. The cup the just keeps shaking. Normally you have a paper towel under it. So yeah, I do. So you don't hear it. Well, so it doesn't wobble, wobble. It does wobble, that baby, too. wobble, baby. <laughs> and then you can also do some like off the page too, if you want like a. Yeah, I like this one. 
What baby? So I like this one. Yeah. These ones are a little more flat. Hydrated. I'm gonna show you also in a second what you can do to make them cartoony. Which, which, when you do something like this, that's just like messy, you know. Mm -hmm. Putting in those cartoony lines kind of pulls it together. Later here, look at me knowing some few things, sort of, kind of. You do know some things, sort of, kind of. <laughs> All right, so um, I'm going to dry mine and then show you what we can do next. It's not plugged into the what? wall because I it made, doesn't reach. I made a shiny. I made a shiny. I made a shiny. <sighs> Is there a plug? In view. Is there a plug? It's just way over there, isn't it? I don't see one. I'll be back. I'll be back. I also was not thinking about like it doing that. That's fine. See, like it them. goes through. That's true. Okay, so um, boom. Oh. Foo. Mm hmm Yeah. <laughs> getting hit in the head on my counterweight um so this is one i did and it's um i didn't have the focus on I want this oh kylie what oh no is it not in focus is it not in focus are you not in focus well it's on autofocus why is it not doing oh, okay well it may be like going in and out of focus though because it's on auto anyways I did this one and this one's more neat than what I'm doing now because I wanted to show you different things. Um, but this one is super cute and you can write Merry Christmas over it. I didn't do the last little thing, which I need to, but um, I want to show you on this a different um, style. So you can do like messy bubbles and then take a uh, fine liner. This is a Micron size 05. And to make this kind of cartoony, we're gonna take it and outline these, but like in a scribbly kind of way. Yes. Were you listening to me? I was listening. Okay. To you. So I'm just gonna go like this and circle a few times, and then kind of do that. That was a little wet, so it's messing with the marker. Mm. But do that over all of the um, ornaments, so they're kind of cartoony and kind of go with the, you know? So yeah, I'm gonna, that's pretty. 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 So you can do that to kind of make yours kind of tie in, you know? Very Merry Christmas. But like this version that I'm doing right here, literally anyone can do because it is so messy. But it's cute. And then even after you've done your fine liner, you can go in and add more color if you want. So like some of these, I can do another layer on if I want, but since we are short on time, I'm probably gonna leave mine that way. Um, I might put Merry Christmas somewhere, but this can be a Christmas card and then you can write a note on the back. Um, what? I loved all the paint that was on the back as Is well. Is there paint on the back? Yes, of course, everywhere. you know, that's, that's the way I am. What so. Do, what do I do with this? Um, you can paint the little thingamajiggers or you can draw the little thingamajiggers. Okay. And if you want to set that aside for it to dry while we start another one and then do that later, you can do that too. How do I make the thingamajiggers? Um, I did mine like a gold, but you can do them whatever you want. Well, I have it mixed colors because I'm inexperienced in This that. is gold. Do you want a gold? It's gold? Interesting. This is gold. I never would have guessed that. See? Merry Christmas. Because it looked brown. Yeah, I know. It's actually Quinn gold. Hmm. Interesting. <laughs> I kind of like this. It's so messy, but I love it. No, I love that. 
I love that. I, I love. I love. I love love. All right, so here is my Merry Christmas. Yeah, that was definitely not dry, but it went, which I kind of like actually. Yeah, and you can have little blooms and it makes it really cool. I like that, Kylie, that's beautiful. While you're doing that, I'm gonna prep for our second one um, since we have 20 minutes. If we do the exact same thing, we had 40, now we have 20. What should we paint on this? That's super simple. Any ideas? Okay. I saw so many cats. <laughs> well, I don't know if you can do that in 20 minutes. No, I can't. Is the only problem. I can't. I'm not even done with this one yet. <clears throat> and this is just circles. <laughs> I love that. And this is just circles. <laughs> you heard me. Yeah, that oh really gosh, bled, but it's pretty. I saw that. That is intricate. Oh, and I like the... the, 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 the Branch. Branch. <laughs> Branch. Branch. Oh, that one's cute too with the Merry Christmas. You could write it around the balls. Mm hmm. That's pretty. I like a Christmas tree. I um, kind of like the bleeding gold. Actually. I do too. And when it dries, girl, this is going to be gorgeous. We could do a little Christmas tree like this. Ooh. Do you like that? I do. It is pretty. And I really think you could do this simple. It's beautiful. Do you like the like bag around the roots or would you want something else for the roots? I think the, the I mean the bag it's makes simple. it simple, so. I agree. In case you're wondering. <laughs> there's also the super simple tree where you put tape down in the shape of a triangle. And I saw just, that. There's that, but I kind of like this tree and it looks like it would be more difficult, but I'll show you it's very easy. I'll show you. Yeah, that's beautiful. That's what we're doing, man. We're doing. I kind of think this is cute. I love that. I was worried there in the middle. You were worried? I was worried. Never leave something unfinished. It always gets better. That's beautiful, Kylie. And when that dries, I love that. We shall see how I feel about it in a minute. <laughs> okay, what I'm going to do is give you... Um, a guide for the ball and the stem. Okay. That way you know about where it goes. Okay. 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 So set that to the side, and when that's dry, we'll look at that. Um, but let's move on to card number two. Um, this one is going to be a cute little Christmas tree with like a burlap around the roots. Is that what you would call it? Burlap, burlap sack. Yeah. Burlap. Okay. So. Let's start with the burlap because it's going to be so easy. Okay, so I'm going to mix up a little bit of gold with Van Dyke Brown. Okay, so get some paint. And all you're going to do is kind of fill in very sloppily a little... Kind of like a sack with, you know, like it's tied around here, which we might actually mm -hmm. put a tie on it. Super simple. I'm adding a little bit more pigment around the base of mine. And then slightly around where it's tied, if I can. And then that will dry. See that? Two seconds. Yours is so cute. <laughs> I love it. Um, I actually want to lift some of my color because I like yours. <laughs> See, you can watercolor. Anybody can do this. I promise you. Well, I think it's also because I just don't, I end up like, don't, I end up not liking mine. I like yours. <laughs> That's what ends up happening. Do not compare yourself to others. I think yours is adorable. A total adorable. A, to a total adorable. A total. Okay, so we're gonna take, this is um, Daniel Smith's Tiger's Eye um, Brown. What'd you say? Um, so let's get some of this paint here. 
So I'm going to turn my page this way just so I can do the whole line thing, you know, for the trunk. Um, and just do a line going up and you can make, I'm actually going to make it thicker down here, but try and get pointy at the top and it can touch your sack if you want. <laughs> your burlap sack, it can touch that and bleed into it if you need. We're loving it. Can't laugh while doing this. Oh, I like I like that. I like the that makes the whimsicalness of it. I like that. It's a happy little accident. It's perfect, actually, Kylie. Um, I don't want to touch it anymore. <laughs> do not touch. Okay, and then we're gonna take a little bit of this I and be a baby tree. It's okay. I think it's adorable. <laughs> and so these branches are gonna go upward. Yeah. Like this. Um, and so there's going to be leaves on these so mm -hmm. um, they don't have to be too big or too thick or anything. This is just going to be like the foundation okay. of what we're doing. Okay. More scary lines. Make them wobbly, Kylie. It gives them character. I meant to make them longer. Yeah, I'm kind of going back and making mine a little irregular because I want them to be irregular. There's the foundation of my tree. The foundation of your tree. Mm -hmm. <sighs> what kind of color of green do we want? Do we want kitty kind of cartoony green or mature green? I don't know. We're going to go with this one. I need a space for our green. I love it, Kylie. I'm so in love with yours. This is one of my favorite greens in Daniel Smith. And I can't remember the name of it at the moment. It's something genuine. I love it. I love it. I love it even more. I love it even more. <laughs> okay. So. Um, I made this like a little weird, but. I know it's perfect. I like the. <laughs> it's perfect. We're going to take. I feel like it's too up though. See, I put like another one at the base of mine because yeah. I, I felt like I did that too. Um, I actually like just, the, yeah, that's, it, yours is going to be so cute. Okay, so we're going to get some green on the tip of our brush. And what you're going to do is you're just going to tap. Are you, are you watching? You're just going to tap your yeah. brush, the tip of your brush along both sides and try not to make it um, the same. Try to do it like sporadically and leave some holes for little Christmas ornaments and stuff. Um, but just go down all the branches. I Just go for it, girl. I don't know how to fix that. You can take paper towel and just go bye-bye. Bye-bye. <laughs> it didn't happen. <laughs> Just like that. And if you want to like go down one side at a time, that way you don't have to keep changing the angle of your brush. And then like mine, I feel like I'm gonna need another branch in between and we can add that. But just tap the tip of your brush along in an irregular manner. See, it's the irregular that's hard for me. Yeah, just kind of plop, 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 plop. Plop, 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 plop. And you can do different thicknesses of paint as well if you want some like lighter areas and darker areas and just kind of go in the area of the branches. My branches are way too sparse. I'm going to need some more branches. <laughs> I didn't get enough branches on mine. Mine looks so sad. Looks Look at my little tree. <laughs> I think it's so sad and cute at the same time. It's a baby. It's okay. <laughs> It hasn't filled out. It's no. <laughs> That's so funny. So I'm going in, Kylie, now with, I've got some little, oh, yours is perfect. I'm putting in some like bigger leafies in mine because mine just looks sad. <laughs> it looks sad. 
I, I'm gonna put in some branches here. <laughs> some branches. My poor tree. That's a little better. We're getting there. <laughs> I love it. But after we have our little leafies in, we're just going to put little ornament balls. And again, they don't need to be um, perfect. Just little dots within the tree. How's it going, girl? I don't know. You don't know? I don't know. I are, you, I, are you liking it? I think. I don't know. I think it's adorable. <laughs> Mine's starting to fill out a little bit. Mine's getting some meat on the bones. Yeah. Yours is pretty. I like yours. Yours is pretty, though. Yours is pretty. But it is. It's it's so interesting how different hands do things differently. Yeah. yeah. Well, how different art is even if you're making the same thing. Uh-huh. I love it. All oh, the batteries flashing at us. Yay. Okay, so I'm going to go ahead and start putting little balls in mine. Um, I feel like mine doesn't look like a um, I like tree, I love the shape of yours a lot. I love how irregular it, like it's just perfect. <laughs> Once you put little ornaments in there, it'll look like a Christmas tree. True. Any tree can be a Christmas tree if it's decorated. This is true. I need a different brush for the balls. Mocha balls! <laughs> Seriously, watch that video. Art Dice. Check it out. We thought of it at the same time. It's because I said the word balls. I know, Boca balls is ever, forever going to be that. I'm gonna get a small I I brush. Like I love yours, Kylie. <laughs> this one's bleeding into the leaves. Oh, no. But look, we just tap it and lift it. It's okay. It's all okay. It's all okay. Kylie, I love yours so much. <laughs> it's beautiful. <laughs> okay, let's get some purple. I think it's perfect. Kylie, it's beautiful. <laughs> and then um, just know if there's like a really wet spot when you put another color, it's going to bleed into it. Yeah. Um, I'm going to put some bright. I can't tell. <laughs> I can't tell what's wet. And what's wet. So I got a smaller brush to do the little ornaments. I would, yeah. I would recommend it. I, I would agree with that because this one's pretty big for the little ornaments. All right, we're doing good. We are almost done, guys. <laughs> it feels so tiny. I know. So here's what mine's looking like in here. Oh, Kylie, yours is so beautiful. <laughs> so um, the battery is dying. I'm going to actually stop the camera and come back when we're done, show you the finished look, look, finished product. What, what are these? Cards. Cards. And then we'll wrap this video up. All right, so here are our finished Christmas trees. How cute is that? And then, Kylie, let's look at your ornaments. You can pull it up here, see if it's dry now. Should be. Is that right? Oh, that's, oh, that's beautiful. I love this that. one. Yep, I love it. So there's just a couple of ideas for Christmas cards, and um, I had fun. I love your tree. It's yeah. beautiful. The, the tree is growing on me. I like it. Yep. All right, guys, but that is going to wrap it up for this video. I hope that you're having a wonderful holiday season. Um, but if you enjoyed this, please give it a thumbs up. And if you haven't already and you want to see our future videos, hit that subscribe button down, down below, below. And we'll see you guys next time. Bye. Bye. There was like a house driving down the road. <laughs> it, was a, it was like, I saw this roof just going down the road. Can, can we start now? Yes. Okay. Kylie, <laughs> 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 we gotta focus. We gotta focus. I'm we gotta sorry. focus. <laughs>